Business host Maria Bartiromo's interview was shameful. Photo illustration by Slate. Screenshot via Twitter. President Donald Trump called into Fox Business Network on Thursday morning to do what he does best, rant and rave and howl at the moon during a particularly unspooled interview. Even by Trump's standards, with host Maria Bartiromo, Trump unleashed on his favorite fevered topics of the day, Hillary Clinton's emails, prosecuting his political rivals, the curse China put on the US, voter fraud, mailmen being indicted, in some, the most important issues facing the country. That was all in addition to his patently unsound medical advice about the pandemic. After watching the interview, it's hard not to come to the conclusion that Trump has come completely undone. Here are some highlights, as it were. China did this. This was all done by China. And we shouldn't be hurting our workers because China put the curse on. We shouldn't be hurting our workers because China put the curse on. Trump is now accusing China of putting a curse on the US. Twitter.com slash shinevopel 0 j 4 Aaron Rupa, Aditrapa, October 8, 2020. These people should be indicted. This was the greatest political crime in the history of our country. And it includes Obama and it includes Biden. Unless Bill Barr indicts these people for crimes, the greatest political crime in history of our country, then we'll get little satisfaction. And that includes Obama and that includes Biden. Trump calls for Obama and Biden to be charged with crimes. Pick.twitter.com slash G4VIX98ZJ, Aaron Rupa, Aditrapa, October 8, 2020. FBI Director Chris Ray has been disappointing. He talks about the voting thing. He doesn't see the voting ballots as a problem. They're cheating all over the place on the ballots, how is that not a problem? That's a much bigger problem than China or Russia. He's been disappointing. Trump throws FBI Director A under the bus pick.twitter.com slash 15th tweet 60FZ, Aaron Rupa, Aditrapa, October 8, 2020. These are cheaters, these are conmen, these are cheaters we're dealing with in Nevada, there's bad things happening out there, they're sending out millions of ballots. Mailmen are being indicted. We have law enforcement watching him very strong. The U.S. attorney is watching the Gov of Nevada very strongly. The U.S. marshal is watching. In New Mexico, a state I think we can win. We have the U.S. marshal and the U.S. attorney watching him. Trump on his concerns with mail ballots. Pick.twitter.com slash th3 alafita0, Aaron Rupa, Aditrapa, October 8, 2020. She deleted 33,000 emails illegally and she should be indicted for that. Nothing happens to her. I'm going to have to get involved. Trump is ranting and raving about indicting Hillary Clinton. Pick.twitter.com slash s1 alroof 2p, Aaron Rupa. Aditrapa, October 8, 2020 I am not happy about him, for that, Trump criticizes Pompeo for not finding Hillary's emails pic.twitter.com slash svrio 9 atai, Aaron Rupa, Aditrapa, October 8, 2020, Biden won't be president for two months, he's not mentally capable of being president. Everyone knows that. And this monster that was on stage with Mike Pence last night, this monster, everything she said is a lie. Trump, refers to Kamala Harris as this monster pic.twitter.com slash hcn fake pbf, Aaron Rupa, Aditrapa, October 8, 2020 What kind of cocktails were they prescribing this guy at Walt to read again? Let's block ads. Why? Show your love for him. Click the link in description. Thanks for watching.